You're watching Fox 17 News. Thanks for staying with us this afternoon. I'm Derek Francis. I'm Janice Allen. We're seeing it more and more out on the roads. People who are driving with no license plates on their vehicles. Yeah, police say they're seeing it as well, and they're going to start pulling people over for it. Our Lauren Evers joining us live after hearing from police and a concerned citizen about this very topic. Lauren. Yeah, Derek and Janice, I don't know if you guys are seeing it, but I am just out and about cars just with no license plates. And it is pretty startling. Police saying the same thing, too, that they're startled. But now when they see it, they're going to do something about it. Just a, about a week or so ago, I saw two cars in the same day without a license plate and no registration paper at all in the back window. Bob McNally drives about 500 miles a week for work throughout West Michigan, and lately he's been seeing this, people driving with no license plates. Just this week, a couple more, and I was in um, uh, Benton Harbor the other day, two days ago. Car went by, no license plate at all. And it's happening here in the Grand Rapids area, like on Alpine. In each and every case, it was an older model vehicle, like at least a 10-year-old uh, uh, sedan. But in all the cases, they were all like sedans, old, old cars. And it's also going on downtown. Fox 17 stood at the intersection of Fulton and Division and in 45 minutes got video of 11 people with no license plates and no note in their windows. But we're past the point of it's okay to drive around without a license plate because of COVID. We're past that point. All registration, proof of insurance, all those offenses are, are back available to be enforced. Sergeant Dan Adams with GRPD says they understand that the Secretary of State relaxed the rules a little bit during the pandemic last year and it wasn't a necessity to get it done immediately. But as we're getting vaccinated, moving into hopefully a recovery from COVID, um, you know, we're going to be out there. The weather's getting nice. People are going to be out driving around and, and we'll be out there enforcing those kinds of things. Because he says if you get into an accident of any kind, the penalties could be much worse. By this point, Secretary of State is available to do those things and we recommend people get out and get those done. And so Sergeant Adams, he also said that, you know, if you get pulled out, pulled over on these roads and you have an appointment scheduled, show the officer an email or some sort of documentation proving that that's actually going to happen. He says it could save you from some fines. Reporting live in Grand Rapids, Lauren Edwards, Fox 17 News. That Van Andel Arena.